Welcome back to Race Mountain Speedway. It's time for the semi-final round in the Porsche Summer Tournament. We've got 12 drivers remaining. Let's take a look at Heat 1. Andrew Nixon will be in the pole driving for 4114 Diecast Racing. He's in that Porsche 911 GT3 RS. Next to him in second position is MJY5 Racing Gamer. He's in that FTE Carrera GT. He'll be driving for Redline Salvage Inc. Back to the second row, we have J. Dean 439 in that red Carrera. He'll be driving for Hot Wheel Racer Mike. Next to him, we have Jim L. driving the Porsche 934 Turbo RSR. He's also driving for Hot Wheel Racer Mike. Going back to the third row, we have Oreste Diamore driving the Porsche Panamera. He'll be the third driver in this race for Hot Wheel Racer Mike. And finally back in sixth position is Mr. Mom's Racing, driving the Porsche 911 Turbo. This one is a matchbox sponsored by Guitarded and Broke. Also, we've added a chicane to the track for today's race. This will add an extra challenge for the drivers. The track goes from three lanes wide down to two, and they'll have to maneuver around those turns. This will be a four lap race with the top three advancing on to the final round. And the drivers are off. Andrew Nixon and MJY5 side by side going around that first turn. MJY5 pulls ahead going through the chicane. And MJY5 Racing Gamer will be leading going into lap two, followed by Andrew Nixon and Oreste Diamore. He's followed by Jay Dean and Jim L. Mr. Mom's Racing having some problem with that car. They're stuck over at turn two. They've got a lot of ground to make up if they want to get in that top three. MJY5 leading down the ramp, Oreste Diamore in second, and he wrecks! MJY5 losing control, coming out of the chicane. Andrew Nixon is closing the gap, and both drivers get stuck inside the merger. Here comes Jim L. Looks like JD 439 and Mr. Mom's Racing ran out of momentum right before turn two. Oreste Diamore on his roof in that Porsche Panamera, and there goes the track crew to help him out. Let's take a look at what happened on turn one. He was trying to pass MJY5 on the inside, ended up going up on two wheels, and then just flipped over. Here it is from another angle. He was just a little too aggressive right there. MJY5 Racing Gamer catching a little air off that hill. That's gonna put Oreste Diamore all the way back in sixth place as we restart the second lap. MJY5 with an early lead. He comes flying out of turn one. He's slowing down around two but he still has a huge lead out there. And look at that, Oreste Diamor goes from sixth place up to second. Impressive driving, especially after that wreck. Jim L having troubles. His car got sideways out there on the track. Look at that Carrera GT flying through the air. Amazing recovery by MJY5. He was spinning out of control, but managed to maneuver it through the chicane and got his car back going straight again. Here we go with lap three. MJY5 and Oreste Diamore in the front right now. Andrew Nixon back in third place. MJY5 with a strong lead in today's race. Whoa, he pops up on the side wall. But his car is past the finish line, so he will maintain that first place spot going into the fourth and final lap. We'll have to check out the finish line footage to see what happened there. Mr. Mom's Racing having all types of trouble with that car and it's not looking much better for Jim L. Here's another look at MJY5. He bounces back and forth in that merger right before he takes a hit from Oreste Diamore. So it's gonna be MJY5, Oreste Diamore in the front row going down the fourth lap, followed by Andrew Nixon and J. Dean 439. Here we go, this is it. Only the top three will advance. MJY5 with an early lead, he goes high on the turn, and Oreste Diamore passes. MJ looking for an opening, and Oreste Diamore takes a checkered flag, followed by MJY5 Racing Gamer and J. Dean 439 in the red Porsche Carrera. A tough break for Andrew Nixon, coming in fourth place. He started off this race in the pole position, but ends up fourth. Mr. Mom's Racing stalling out pretty much in the same place every time, along with Jim L. Here's another look at that final lap. MJY5 goes too high on that turn, comes down too soon, hitting the inside wall, 
and that was just the opening Oreste Diamore needed to take the lead. He did a great job navigating through the chicane. Right here, he lost a little bit of speed, but was able to block MJY5 as he tried to pass on the inside. Both Oreste Diamore and J. Dean 439 were driving for the Hot Wheel Racer Mike team. That means he has two drivers going into the finals. MJY5 Racing Gamer was driving for Redline Salvage Inc. Don't go anywhere, we've got Heat 2 of the semifinals coming up after the break. Welcome back. It's the semifinal round in the Porsche Summer Tournament. Three drivers have already advanced, and there's room for three more. Let's take a look at Heat 2. Driving the new Panamera Turbo S E-Hybrid Sports Turismo is Noble Steed X46, driving for the 3D Botmaker team. Next to him is Mod My Ride, driving the 918 Spider. He'll be driving for Michael's Diecast Garage. Going back to row two, we have Andrew Hind in that green 911 GT3 RS. He'll be driving for Guitarded and Broke. Next to him will be Hunter Cordray. He's driving that blue Carrera GT. He'll be the second driver in this race for the Guitarded and Broke team. Back in the third row, we have Darth Crane. He'll be driving in that orange 993 GT2. He's driving for JX4 Racing. And finally, back in 6th place is Thunder, driving the blue Panamera Matchbox Edition. He's driving for Guitarded and Broke. This will be a 4-lap race. There's 3 more spots in the finals. Who's gonna take it? Mod My Ride with a slight lead coming down the ramp. He gets sideways going through the chicane. Noble Steed makes contact and pulls ahead. And it'll be Noble Steed and Mod My Ride in the first two positions going into lap two, followed by Hunter Cordray, Darth Crane, and Andrew Hind. Thunder having some problems, he stuck over at the entrance of turn two. And here we go with lap two. Mod My Ride pulling ahead. He's followed by Noble Steed. He chases him through the chicane. Both drivers slowing down. We've got some contact on the track as Andrew Hine pulls ahead to take first place going into lap three. There's three drivers stuck over on the track before the second turn. A lot of paint swapping going on out there. Andrew Hind and Mod My Ride in the front row coming down the ramp. Mod My Ride out in the lead again. Driving that 918 Spider, he's all by himself. As Mod My Ride takes the first place position, going into the fourth and final lap. He's followed by Andrew Hind and Noble Steed X46. Hunter Cordray will be in fourth, followed by Thunder and Darth Crane, who once again could not make it down to the finish line. This is it, the fourth and final lap. Only the top three will advance on to the final round. Noble Steed looking to pass on the inside of that turn. Noble Steed with a bump and run. Mod by right getting knocked all over the place on the track back there. And it's going to be Noble Steed, followed by Hunter Cordray. And only two drivers have passed the finish line, so the remaining four will have to race again for that third place spot. Let's take another look at that last lap. Mod by right out once again with an early lead, but right there, Noble Steed tries to make a pass. Mod by right enters the chicane going sideways. And right there, look at that bump and run by Noble Steed as he makes the pass to take the checkered flag. Here we go, we have four drivers, but only one spot left in the finals. Mod My Ride with an early lead. He's clean through turn one, navigates the chicane beautifully, clean through turn two, and an amazing lap by Mod My Ride as he takes the final spot in the Porsche Summer Tournament Finals. That lap was executed perfectly. Just look at the way he handles the chicane. He had his speed just right, here he goes navigating around turn two. Smooth and clean all the way around. Noble Steed, Hunter Cordray, and Mod My Ride will be the final three drivers moving on to the tournament finals. They'll be joining Oreste Diamore, MJY5 Racing Gamer, and JDean 439 
Here's a look at the team Hot Wheel Racer Mike with two drivers advancing on to the final round. 3D Bot Maker, Redline Salvage Inc., Guitar and Broke, and Michael's Diecast Garage, all with one driver. And here's a look at the tournament contest. MJY5 favored to win. We have 28 contestants still in it. It's all going to come down to the finishing order of the final race to determine who's going to be in the next tournament. And there you go, the six finalists in the Porsche Summer Tournament. Only one of them can advance to the 3D Botmaker Diecast Racing League 2019 Finals. Which driver will it be? You've been watching the 3D Botmaker Diecast Racing League, the home of Diecast Sports Action Racing. I can see the fire escape And you can read my mind, that's why you're heading there